I know you're still angry with me about what I did to live, but honestly, I was doing it for you. I'm just fed up with you telling me what's for my own good. I don't want to end up like the rest of your Liv's family. You've all turned your back on her when she needs you the most. You know, I thought Dingles were supposed to stick up for each other. But after what Liv did, she deserves it. Yes, she's made mistakes, Mum, but none of us are perfect, are we? And I also know she didn't kill Ben, but I seem to be the only person who believes in that. So if I don't visit her, who else will? Yeah, yeah. And I'm sorry for what she is facing, but you're better off out of it. There's nothing you can do to help. Well, I can be there for her until they realise she's innocent. Not gonna happen. The police think she's guilty. It wouldn't be the first time they got it wrong, would it? <laughs> Liv? Sorry, uh, who's this? When did this happen? Yeah, yeah, I'll, I'll be there as soon as I can. Hey, what's happened? Liv needs me. Hey, we've spoke about this. She can't keep putting everything on you. Don't understand, Mum. She's she's in the prison hospital. She's got all of some booze and she's collapsed. As if things weren't bad enough. She is her own worst enemy, that girl. Why do you all blame her for everything? Can't you see how frightened she must be to be, to be driven to that? You say she's frightened? Maybe she started drinking again because she's finally feeling guilty. Yeah, I'm not wasting any more time arguing with you. And do you know what? You're all the same, you dingles, setting yourselves up as a, as a judge and jury. Well, I am not turning my back on Liv. Even if the rest of you do, I'm going to go see her. Right, just you wait! Oh, you don't talk on me out of it, Mum! I don't intend to. I'm offering to drive you. And why would you do that? Because I happen to care about you. I'm looking at the state of you. I want to get you there safe. Go on. Thanks for driving me, but you might as well go home now. I'll make my own way back. Why don't mind waiting? I could go with you. Absolutely not, no. no. I don't want you upset and live again. I'm not worried about her. I'm worried about you. What she's putting you through. I don't need protecting from Liv, all right? I mean, because I want to, you know, she's the one going through it, and I just. I just want to help her. You've got to start facing the truth, sweetheart. Right. If she gets found guilty, she's going to be in that prison for years. What are you going to do? Keep visiting her forever? Or are you going to start thinking about your own future? I won't let you part of my future, Mum! And she's not going to be found guilty because she's innocent, and I'm, I'm going to prove it. Well, you're not a detective! How are you going to prove it when the police can't find any evidence for it? Because maybe they're not looking in the right places. And maybe they think it's easy to pin it on Liv, you know, same as you all do. But that's what you want to believe. But the rest of us, we're looking at it as it is. And we know she's going to get banged up for a very long time. Just go on, Mum, all right? I don't want to be anywhere near you.